Hi everyone, here is Akta and welcome back on my YouTube channel and today I want to show you the team I used in order to clear the stage 29 of the Blue Mark Tower with 3 stars. So this is this team right here. As you can see my Queen Line didn't have any exclusives yet. I'm using other great units but before we jump into the content, as always, if you enjoy it, please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you so much. So, this is the team I used. I was using Guhana to heal my heroes, also uh, she is kind of nice because she can lower the direct damage of my heroes by 12%. Uh, with the third exclusive this is even better because it remains during all the battle, but it's not mandatory here. I am using Tuck, Tuck is a great unit, if you don't have any exclusives on him you can just block uh, the second ability so you won't freeze enemies and you won't freeze your allies. And and you can bring him in your team just to um, apply the shield 40% of his max HP and increase the total max HP of your allies by 25%. This is the, the best usage you can have with Tuck. And then you have uh, Nazil. He is clearly here in order to um, freeze enemies, but um, you can't. You can replace him by another unit. Uh, I mean, you can use Dustin if you are lucky enough to have him. This is an epic unit. Uh, I'm gonna record another video uh, after this one and showing you some content with Dustin. As you can see, I don't have him build yet uh, on this video, but I regressed my Norma in order to build him. So I will uh, show you some content on this stage with Dustin, you will see he is a great unit. I am using Luff with only two, two exclusives. I hope I will get more exclusives, more copies of him uh, on the next summoning session. And finally, I'm using a Queen Land without exclusives in order to uh, make some extra damage, HP, HP burning damage. So uh, yeah, uh, let me run the video and let's see how it works. So I was pretty sure I could be able to almost clear the Blue Mark Tower using these heroes uh, because they are really, really, really strong. I have a good heals, a d damage, direct damage reduction. I have a speed down on the boss, speed, down, speed up on my heroes, uh, HP a bonus, 25% uh, HP bonus on my heroes, uh, a 40% shield, some controls and some HP burnings. So this is almost the perfect team. So, as you can see, I am trying to kill enemies without using too much uh, skills, so I can keep some for the next wave. This is always really important, because this wave is the most annoying one. Because all enemies here are red mark, okay? They counter my blue mark heroes, so uh, Sigmunds and uh, lose or uh, dealing a crazy amount of damage on my units. So this is important to try to freeze them at the moment. So I'm gonna try to kill first maybe Sigmund because he is the most annoying one here. Because he can apply a shield and he can counter attack so that deals more damage to my heroes. But Christian is also annoying here because he can apply another shield on all units and this can be annoying. Quinlan is a great unit to bring here because if enemies have uh, an HP burning on them, when he uses his ultimate he will have some chance to freeze them. So that adds extra controls in the team and this is really useful. So now as you can see all enemies are almost dead. Uh, Luz has a lot of HP burnings on him and this is done. So let's try the boss now. So the controls are great here because I won't have to tank uh, both enemies here so I only have to tank the boss but I can shield myself so uh, normally this is this is nice but we have to be careful on against this boss because with he one of his skill he can uh, remove the buffs on one of your allies so this can be really dangerous so as you can see, this is a bit difficult with Love because he is not super super reliable. He has only 40% chance to apply an HP burning on enemies. So this is not uh, this doesn't proc every time. 
So I'm going to try to apply more HP burnings on the boss and try to keep the shield as often as I can on my heroes in order to stay alive. Uh, uh, um, so, Nazil now is almost useless. He is a heal in order to uh, protect one ally, but he is not really tanky at the moment because I'm using him for the arena and I have only effect hit on him. I don't have a lot of HP uh, or uh, defense on him, so he can't protect anything. Okay, so 3 HP burnings on the boss, this is nice. I'm gonna increase my max HP and apply a shield, so um, it will increase the damage I will do to the boss with HP burnings. So this is a great uh, combo to use. 69%, But as you can see, my Guhana doesn't have a lot of effect hit, so she almost never applies the speed down on the boss. He always resists. He has maybe 72% effect res, I think, something like this. If I'm not mistaken. So this is hard. And... Okay, as you can see, I just lost one hero, so let's retry the boss battle one more time. So this is another uh, entire fight, okay? I, I had to deal with uh, the two previous waves, but... Uh, I cut it on the montage. So I'm trying to do the same here. The goal is to uh, kill enemies first, Yoko and Shia first. So now I, ha I just have to tank the boss. So I'm increasing my turn meta, I'm trying to deal more damage. Trying to freeze. And Yoko resisted, but it's okay, she's, she's dead now. Only Shia remaining, but she has an HP burning, she's gonna die at her turn. And now only the boss will remain, so it should be easier. Here I want to keep the buff for the next turn so I can uh, tank the ultimate and the second ability of the boss. It is really important because he hits really really hard using these skills. So you want to keep the shield to tank these skills. Now the, the boss had 5 HP burnings on him, so he took a lot of damage and now I want to inflict more HP burnings on him if I can, but as you can see, the boss always resists almost every HP burnings. This is a bit bad because I lack, uh, I lack effect hit on my heroes at the moment. Okay. And only 1 HP burnings on 3 applied on the boss. Yeah, this is hard to apply HP burnings with Luff. It, it, can, it can be great, but it's really hard. He doesn't have a lot of chance to apply HP burnings. So, But now I am s more safe because the boss has the speed down reduction on him thanks to Guhana. So I can apply more dots and I have less attacks to tank. So only 47% HP remaining. So I have the ally protection on Quinlan. I prefer um, that my uh, that my Nazil uh, take damage than my Quinlan because my Quinlan is more squishy than my Nazil. So I think I can uh, make my uh, Quinlan survive if I do that. And also I can heal him if I redo the, the ally protection on him with Nazil, so this is important. 36% HP remaining, 2 procs of HP burning, this is great. Let's increase the turn meta. 5 HP burnings, 3 more remainings on the boss, this is interesting. So I'm applying more, 4 HP burnings, I don't have the buffs on my heroes, so uh, 
I survived this, but this was really hard. I, I have been lucky to resist uh, with all my heroes. So the boss is almost dead, 20% remaining. And he has one more time the speed down on him, so this is great. So should I do uh, the second ability? No, I don't want to uh, lose HP with my queen line. I have to stay alive. But this is hard. As you can see, my love is almost dead. And I don't have the buffs on my heroes. So <laughs> I have been really, really lucky because he didn't target my love. Otherwise, he should be dead now. And let's do this on the boss. Only one proc. Let's apply one more. 4 HP burnings on the boss. So I'm gonna protect my love. So now... He is almost dead, I'm gonna shield myself and now with the shield normally I am safe so I'm gonna try to apply more dots and kill the boss. So normally it should be fine and his turn is gonna die. Let's apply one more and yeah this is it. This is it, 3 stars on the boss, this is great. So uh, look at the damage, uh, Love is doing almost the same as uh, Queen Lan here without exclusives and others are just uh, here to help my heroes to tank. But at the moment I am trying to uh, make this stage in Noto, so I have Queen Lan exclusive 1 at the moment, I'm planning to get his second exclusive in the future, and I'm also using Dustin at the moment with 3 exclusives instead of uh, Nazil. So I'm gonna record another video and try to show you how I deal with this stage in auto. Uh, this is a bit hard at the moment because I like uh, blue marks on my talents. So my blue mark heroes are not that great at the moment, but trust me, in the future, normally it should be better. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If it's the case, as usual, please like, comment and subscribe and then see you in the next one. Bye bye. Infinite Magic Raid. Play to slay.